This is our new agricultural heritage barn here at Mahaffey Stagecoach Stop and Farm Historic Site. This building stands on the location of the Mahaffey's largest barn that they built in 1872. Somewhere by 1950, it had to come down. And so for the folks who were living here and farming here at that time, they put up a small barn. It was in very bad shape and in danger of coming down on its own. With our livestock program and the growth of that program with all the farming activity we do now, longtime benefactor Marin Moore stepped forward and donated the funding to build this wonderful new 8,500 square feet building. Now that has the size uh, that we need to do all these activities uh, to care for the animals and exhibit our equipment. We've got some banners to illustrate the different seasons of the year on the farm and the activities that go on. That is the area where a lot of the farm implements, stagecoach, covered wagon, chuck wagon, the different implements will be. The cattle zone will be all our ox yokes so people can see how the oxen grow and you know, require a yoke as they grow. On the other corner will be uh, some exhibits about horses and their sizes and how horses are measured. The center driveway of the barn will allow us to drive the stagecoach all the way through and park it, but then it'll have plenty of space to train animals. Visitors can come right inside here and be part of that. I think um, Mahaffey, uh, one of the things that sets itself apart from other living history sites is the animals, the variety of animals we have. These possibly could have been breeds that you might have seen here if you were at the Mahaffey farm in the late 1860s. So the south end of the barn is very specifically uh, oriented towards the animals. Stalls for the horses, uh, an animal bath <laughs> where we can bathe the animals, uh, clean them up year round, and then hay storage at the far end. We're really trying to focus on the visitor experience. We want them to come and experience and ask questions, and if there's something that they can do that's hands-on, that's our ultimate goal. The barn lets us take better care of our animals. It will allow the public to get much closer to them, and this adds yet another dimension to the kinds of activities we can offer. 